Hello, and welcome back to Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. So, things have been going really well. After Gary's break, um, to let the radiation die out and his mutation set in, he returned to the lab, and it was cool because I started to explore the subway station around it, and I, my suspicion was correct. This is called a central train depot. So you'll see over here, there's this computer. And basically these are tunnels to other big ass labs. So Gary thinks he might spend a few, who knows, maybe even like a week or two down here just raiding them. Um, I was able to hack this computer and get the data for the labs. So I know one's over here and one's over here, but and then I could go to the right too, there's gonna to be stuff over here. But something is freaking me out. This is why I wanted to start recording right this second. Um, look at the layout. So look at the layout of this place. It's like the right side is super big. If you recall, there was actually a vault over here. And then if I go over here and I go to where there's supposed to be a vault, uh, it's just like all these walls. So I figured I just missed a door. I saw there was this door that maybe leads in there, but those don't usually lead in there like that. Those doors in the corners usually go into like fucking, um, those doors in the corner usually go into like little supply closets, but you know, Gary is thinking about what happened in the mansion, and he's having a suspicion there might be something behind this wall, too. So, look, I, what I had to do was I had to go get another jackhammer, and then instead of running all the way back to my base, I just went into the subway stations to loot them. So look at how ghetto this is. I didn't have one container. So I have four flasks on my hip, all filled with gasoline. Um, I have this cool new gun called the HK-417, it's 7.62. This is my first 7.62 rifle, so this one's more powerful. Okay. I'm gonna just try... I feel like right here, or even like here, and I go down with... Let's try this. Okay, so there's definitely something over here. Rebar cage. Shit, I have to break that with something. I wonder if a grenade would break it. Watch how you throw a grenade. You wield it, then you activate it to pull the pin, then you throw it. And then you run. <laughs> My ears are ringing, I should have put earplugs in. I need to make something that can break that rebar cage. Can I, like, make a... Instead of going all the way home, I'd rather see if I can just make something. Great pipe mace. Two pipes. Two sets of pipe fittings. Come on, we're so close. I don't know, this might be for nothing, because I, I don't really know what I'm seeing in there yet. That might just be some, uh, like some dumbass room. Can I really not? Oh, well, it's a utility shelf, that's why. Here, let's do this. 
So remember, to destroy items takes bashing. So I just found this plank. Now I can break these. Large wooden club. Now it's only 16. I need a lot more than that. I gotta make this great pipe mace, I think. Oh, where do I get pipe fittings? Fuck. Nice, this thing had him. <laughs> I just destroyed this huge ass. This is the ingenuity of this game. Nice, here we go. I can make the great pipe mace using all the shit I just broke together. Okay, great pipe mace. Wield, this has 37 bash, which should be enough for the task of smashing something like that. God, I hit my head though by the falling debris. That sucked. I'm lucky that didn't hurt me worse. Nice, I broke it. The zombies are starting to come through. Alright, let's get my gun. Ah, uh, fuck, what do I do with that? Damn, I lost my gun. Hiding, I was so dumb. Okay, <laughs> man, I got nervous. I was like, did I really just lose my gun? All right. Okay. So there's definitely stuff in here. Oh shit, are these what I think they are? Oh, nice. There's good stuff. There's plutonium fuel cells in here. You can make really good stuff with that. What else is in here? Okay, a bunch of normal crafting stuff. Oh, look, there's a door down here. Okay. I don't know, it still seems like I can go, I can go west. This is the central lab. Yes, it worked. There was fucking, there was like a hidden, oh my God. Okay. Yes. Gary grips his gun with excitement. If I found good shit before, who knows what good shit I'm gonna find here. Although you gotta be really careful. There's, there's extremely ridiculous enemies that can spawn in here, especially now that it's so late game. Well, it's not that late game, but... Oh. It is, like, more than a month in. Okay, perfect. I was hoping to find one of these. I want to take the sling off. Yeah, give me that shoulder strap. I want to put that on my gun. Because I keep having to fucking drop my gun on the ground and pick it up. So let's just do this real quick. Yes. What is this? An experimental subject was accidentally terminated today and revivification was seen as in Dr. Duro's report. This time we were ready for it and the specimen was kept for observation. Wow, so they were like studying. <laughs> they were studying the zombies before the apocalypse. And then I just downloaded map data. Oh, nice. It just fucking gave me this huge, look at that. It just gave me this huge circle of data for the map. Excellent. Okay, let's keep going. Same kind of shit. I'll check these more later. Wow, I'm in a central lab. This I haven't been in one of these in a while. Let's see what the point G central lab is like. 
grown food in here. Uh, a bunch of ash in here, that's weird. Some weed. Ha! <laughs> There's some fucking weed in here. I love that. So far, nothing too... Too crazy about... Whoa! Whoa, look at this guy. A robot body with the head of a human. Wow. I'm shooting that fucking thing. Bam. Nice one shot. That's the nice thing about 7.62, it ain't like that 5.5. Five. Kill shit in one shot. Where's the good stuff? I know these have fucking real good stuff in them. Where's the good stuff? Looks like I can go... I think I'm in the central lab for real. Oh my god, there's fucking robots in the way. I'm trying to yell to see if I can get him to come up. Oh man. I don't want to have to fucking push my way past. That's not good. Alright, try it. It's just me and him. Wait, is that really all this is? Bro, this makes no sense. Fucking look at that, you see that? That's why you want let's oh, set an alarm off. That's why you want super high ass computers, because when you find this shit, you don't
don't want to lock yourself out. You'll make yourself so sad. Wow, so I just found my first CBM. Um, funnily enough, it was the power storage. Like the simplest, most straightforward CBM there is. But a classic. And always useful. Definitely something that's always useful. Like this is where the broken elevators are, so this must go down quite a ways. Looks like there's some sleeping quarters. God damn, this thing is fucking big. Some kind of centrifuge lab. Vats full of fucking who knows what, like cloning vats or something. Finding some rare books down here, that's cool. Keeping my gun out and loaded. This was me back in the day. Literally, this guy I'm killing, that was who I was back in the day. Ooh, a chemistry set. Nice. That's actually pretty good. say you look very impressive but this is a 762 rifle it's gonna hurt oh my god damn how many did that take that took 10 shots i think i think that took 10 shots that was insane from a 762 rifle to kill that fucking zombie hulk i get a proficiency called large humanoids Gary had a whole different mindset about the apocalypse now. Instead of running away in fear, he was diving in, eager for what he would find, and then dissecting his enemies to learn their weaknesses. Wow, this is awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and just end the video early. I wanna see what's in this lab. This is gonna be so cool. We got our first CBM. Uh, let's see what happens to Mr. Gary. <laughs>